A 5,000-meter heat at the Paris Olympics ended in chaos on Wednesday morning. Team GB athlete George Mills was furious after taking a tumble in the first men's 5,000-meter heat at the Paris Olympics. And he confronted Francis Hugo Hay after the race had come to an end. The race proved to be a tactical affair and was run at a sluggish pace, taking more than 90 seconds longer than world record time to complete. And on the home straight, a whole host of athletes collided as four runners were grounded. Mills eventually picked himself up and walked across the finish line. But the 25-year-old wasn't able to hide his anger as he squared up to Hay and pushed his rival in the chest as he made his views perfectly clear. The Frenchman attempted to calm the situation and reason with Mills as he put his arm around the Briton. But Mills was unwilling to make peace with the 27-year-old as he took Hay's hand away and stormed off. Pick up your ultimate guide to the Olympics. Going for Gold provides the day-by-day -day rundown of what's on and when. Click here to buy. Former women's marathon world record holder Paula Radcliffe was unwilling to offer her sympathy to Mills in the aftermath of the incident. As she told the BBC, there's a lot to look back at, a lot to tidy up and decide whose fault it was. If you decide to jog that slightly, it's kind of your own fault. You end up with all of those falls. When there are that many people around, I'm not sure you're going to be able to say, somebody trip me up. There are too many men in there because nobody took it on. Ex-Great Britain 400 meters runner Alison Kerbishley explained on Radio 5 Live. George Mills has done this so many times, he doesn't put himself in the best of positions. You are always going to get yourself caught up when there's too many people. In 1984 Olympics, 1,500 meter silver medalist Steve Cram stated, with the exception of Nordis, most of them have got themselves to blame. George was in a bad position from a long way out and should have checked out much earlier. George, from what I can see, did do a big push there on the home straight. It will be really interesting to see what they decide.